Let's hope I don't get pulled over. I've got my fucking mask on and I can't talk as good. But this is evil. Like, literally. Anybody that would have anything to do with Circe Wallace or her circle, I mean, even LibTech is despicable. They know darn well that Scott Stamus' name is being whored by Circe Wallace. And also, the people behind Colpad is rad. Grindline. Kerry Rogers, Herb Crow, Long Krebs. They're all involved. But yeah, this is unbelievable. Like, I hope I don't get fucking, you know, in trouble. But look at this shit. What the fuck is this? This ain't gonna fly, Travis. I mean, I've always looked up to Travis, because he's you know, out there fucking jumping off the highest lines. And what the fuck is this, Travis? What is this? What is this? Travis, come on. What the fuck is this? This is betraying Scott Stamness because she is kicking me off of Mount Baker where I've been going before she ever was and is uh, behind um, Mark Hubbard's murder that led to Jake Phelps' suicide and why Jeff Grasso wanted to die and, you know, Henry Gartland. This is despicable. It's a tragedy because I know something's going on with Travis Rice. It's not normal. I think he's under soul possession or something. But yeah, that's what's going on. God bless you all. I just want you to understand why I was almost killed and beat with a baseball bat pinned down to the ground. My backpack gone through. Thank God these guys drove by in a truck and stopped this guy who I was stalling. With the, white, you know, the right words and mannerisms, I stalled him from really hurting me. But this is all because of what Terry Rogers and Herb Crow are behind this circle that stretches all the way up to the top of Mount Baker and the Mount Baker ski area. Their social medias are being used to block me out and they're supporting Colpad is Rad. That murderous fraud copycat account it was made after I was brutally assaulted several times at Colpad. Yeah, my Colpad account's the original on Instagram. Colpad is rad is managed by Cersei Wallace and her circle that Yuri Kovachikov had to get behind. And it's murderous. But Yuri's more the bait now than anything. In the beginning he was running more accounts, but he's kind of just more bait because I handed out like 5,000 flyers over like at least six years. Started promoting him seven years ago and drew the attention that he ran the World Wide Web with a, you know, and all top social media domains because uh, I got so pissed off that he was, you know, they were robbing all my, all my friends before I even started telling anybody. So I started like blogging about it after going through like two years of shit. And uh, that's where it started. I was already getting my friends robbed for me on Maui. Like, um, what's that one lady? I forget, Tawny. Yeah, Tawny that my mom used to rent a room from. She betrayed us for the Yuri effect like seven years ago practically in Payahi. She was like one of the first, uh, the wheelchair lady. I can't even think of her last name right now, but yeah. God bless you guys.